guys, Brett here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to our first look at the Weed Farm Simulator. Um, a huge thank you to the dev for sending me through a key to check this game out. It was released, um, I think, late last month, February. Um, still probably released way too early, um, in my opinion, but future content uh, looks really good. Idea looks really good. Um, just needs to be polished a little bit more and have some bugs taken out of it, but... Um, We'll head into new game and have a bit of a look. It'll only be a very, very short video. There's not much you could do really at this early stage of the game, but hopefully I can get you through the little tutorial without too much of an issue. And, um, see what happens. That's us arriving. A little bit of land that we own. Welcome to your new farm. Let's get started. First of all, you need to find a place for your container. You can move it anywhere you like. Click to place it, um, which honestly I can't move it anywhere else. I don't understand why it's telling me I can put it anywhere I like when I really can't, but anyway, place it here. Great. Take a look inside if you like. First let's plant something. Press tab to open inventory. Import a few, few tools with yourself. Select your axe and drag it to your hop bar. Once you cut down a tree, you can use branches for a simple fence around your plantable area. Alright, so cut down some stick, cut down a tree to get some sticks and branches from the tree. Awesome, that's really cool physics. Um, all right. Cut down this thing, see if we get some more from this. Oh, we can't get rid of the bush. That didn't go flying through the air, but not the greatest uh, quality, obviously, of animations and stuff. Um, all right. Drag some of these guys down so we can plant an area. Let's go back over here. We'll plant, uh, plant an area. We'll go here. We'll go straight back. Let's go straight across to there somewhere. Straight ahead. And that'll do. That's one area. Let's make two while we're here, I guess. Um, boom. There we go. Great. In the future, we'll need to buy seeds to plant, but have a few on us. Check inventory, drag your seeds to the hopper, plant some seeds. Right, one, two, three, four, and five. One, two, three, four, and five. Alright, uh, grab the watering can, which is in here. Let's water away, see if we can water all the plants at once. If your plants are fully grown, you can see a leaf icon on them. If you get close to a plant, you can see the three sliders. Um, as you can see the top left of the screen now. So, current growth, current water, and fertilization levels. Obviously, no fertilization at all at the moment. Um, it's not in game yet, I do believe. So, hopefully, that'll be like a future update or something. It is made by a solo developer, so it will take some time to get some new content and stuff. Um, but hopefully we'll get to that point where we can make some cool stuff and um, bring some new updates to get rid of a few bugs and stuff. I found a lot of bugs already, um, a huge amount of bugs, so fingers crossed we can get through this tutorial without any bugs. Um, all right, gardening scissor. But you're ready to go, you're ready, you're ready, you're ready. And so are you. Boom. Those guys aren't ready yet. Let's go and fill up our watering can while we're waiting, I suppose. So once you've harvested, you can get a bud of the corresponding type of weed in inventory. You can sell it or you can roll a joint from it. We can, it says it wants us to sell it, which we will. We'll just go and harvest the rest of these first, I guess. Alright, beautiful. Now let's head into our laptop. Boom. Go sell over there. Fourteen eighty-five. We'll sell those. Awesome. Congratulations, you are ready. All right, let's buy some. Uh, let's buy some double rainbows. Let's see how we go with those. Um, those guys down on our hot bar. So there's an issue there. That slot still thinks there's something there when it's not. Um, and now I can't select those buds on hot bar 5, which is really weird. Um, oh, can we move that to there? There we go. Hot bar 2. Beautiful. 
That hotbar 5, there seems to be a bit of an issue with that. Um, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Let's water these guys in. Go fill up their watering can again and we'll water in the next slot. Hoping I don't find too many more issues at the moment. I just seem to be having a lot, like one of those hot bar 5 doesn't want to work properly. Um, let's move this to hot bar 5. Oh, see, now thinks there's something still in hot bar 5 when there isn't, um, which is very frustrating. Um, now that's stuck up there and it thinks our scissors are in slot 3. Uh, so this is the sort of issues that I've been having. Um, there we go. Right, let's water all these guys. It's really annoying. It's just something so simple that for a game that is fully released on Steam. It is in a really, really early access, but it's fully released for $15, I think, Australian. Um, it's not even ready to be released. It should still be in a really, really early beta phase, to be honest. But um, I guess the dev thought that he would release it, but I don't think it's ready, as I said. But I guess each person can decide for themselves, I guess. So let's leave a bit of space here. Um, Let's try and get another spot in there. I don't think that's even close to being square. I wish they could just let us put in like square plots because that's terrible. Um, right, get that out of there. I'm not going to use hotbar 5. This seems to be just full of issues. Beautiful. So we've got some buds on us. 99. 99, okay, sell 1485, so it's not worth any more than the other lot. Now uh, let's get... What did we sell then? Was it Deep Chill or Double Rainbow? I don't know, let's get... Let's get those guys, why not? Um, slot 4, which won't let us do it either. Slot 2, there we go. I have had issues as well where... Like I put these guys down and then it's going to allow me to put down like a thousand of them without them even taken out of my inventory. So hopefully we don't have that issue again. Um, but we'll see. Right, there we go. See, there we go. I can still plant more, which is really annoying. Um, now my watering can won't work. Slot 2. Neither will you. Can we get you in slot 3? Now I can't get my watering can back. Um, this is the issue that I was having before. <sighs> there we go. Now I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be able to get you into there. Nope. Into there. Nope. Okay. Hopefully we can get these to grow. Hopefully we can cut them. As I said, it's just so many issues. Um, and that's frustrating. I could just imagine how frustrating it is for the guys that have actually paid for the game. Um, as I said, I know it's an indie developer, I know he's probably working his butt off to get it out to the stage it should be at, but just at the moment it's not. Not at the, the level it should be for anybody to be playing it, um, unless it's free um, beta testing sort of thing, as I am at the moment, I guess. Um, I certainly wouldn't want to have to have paid for, paid for the game. Alright, let's water these other guys. Missing that little one over there. Alright, and hopefully we can get this watering can out of our inventory to be able to use our scissors. Fingers crossed. Um, I don't know how it's going to go, but you can see stuck up on the screen in front of us, which is another annoying thing. Frustrating. Um, as I said, it's little things, but for me, um, in any game, it's these little things that really, really matter. Really make a difference in any game. Just the small little things. You can see how many 
possible pots we can have here. Looks like there's a, a pretty decent area that we can build. Obviously, once we get you know tractors and that sort of stuff, that'll be what we can do. But at the moment, we sort of just don't have much going on. Um, I don't know if it's even worthwhile in trying to purchase the tractors because we can't save the game and come back. There's no saving at the moment. Um, why is it not getting that other one? There we go. Oh, yeah, there's nothing. You can't save and leave. Once we leave, that's it. We need to start a new game again, which is another frustrating thing that a lot of people have been um, complaining about at the moment. Um, hoping the developer can, developer can fix that pretty quick, but I guess we'll just have to wait and see. That one. There's no water, so it needs more water. Alright. Cut these guys. Cut, cut. Have to go back and get some more water for that last one. Just want to cut these guys down first because if I don't, that one needs more water as well. Which is weird. Alright, get that out of there. Water. Looks like you get about 10 buds out of each plant, so I wonder if when you get fertilizer if you get more buds or not. I guess we'll have to wait and see when the fertilizer stuff comes out. I'm going to use maybe half the can on this one. Use half the can on the other one. Hopefully they can still grow to full height. like it's gonna good all right get the out of there to there boom and just about ready I think they do grow way too quick though as well um, maybe that's something that dev will look at changing later on but at the moment things just grow way too quick um, all right, go sell okay sell okay sell boom there we go Nearly have enough to buy the tractor. Do have enough for attachments though, so let's have a look. Let's just buy the chisel plow. What the hell? We just lost a ton of money. Okay, um, can we sell that back? Interesting. That was more than three grand. Where did it go? I cannot see it anywhere. Not near inventory. Uh, it's not in our car, obviously. I wonder if we can plant over here too. Pretty cool. Um, yeah. Where did that go? Look, there's a bit of a dirt area up here, which is would have been a good spot to start, I guess. But I cannot see where our chisel plough went. Um, you think it would have either went into inventory or somewhere else. You're clipping through the back of the container there too, which isn't good. Um, yeah, I don't know where that went. But um, I think we'll end it here. You guys get the idea of the game and how it's going to work. Plenty of stuff that they can change. Um, plenty of ideas and that sort of stuff. But at this point in time... I wouldn't recommend paying for it. I would recommend just keeping an eye on it. Um, I'll continue to bring updates as the game progresses along when I re think it's ready for you guys to be able to purchase and play properly. I'll let you guys know as well, but um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, hit the like button, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the future of this game, any ideas you've got to put into the game. Um, if you think the game will be worth it in the long run, let me know, leave it in the comment section. I can provide feedback and put in um, suggested features and stuff if you guys leave it in the comment section as I said um, if you guys are new to the channel yet and haven't subscribed please do so it's been Brito thanks for watching see you again soon